Acute posterior multifocal plaqueoid pigment epitheliopathy usually manifests with a sudden onset of visual blurring or flashing lights in a patient younger than 30 years of age, often preceded by a viral prodrome. Fundus shows multiple bilateral creamy yellow-white plaque-like subretinal lesions, about 1 to 2 disc areas in size in the posterior pole up to the equator. OCT shows hyperreflectivity in the outer retinal layers with loss of the ellipsoid zone. The FFA features are characteristic. There is hypofluorescence corresponding to the fundus lesions in the initial phase and staining in the late phase. The common features of multiple evanescent white dot syndrome and APMPPE are the viral prodrome and the acute onset. However, this condition is unilateral. The white dots are much smaller, about 100 to 200 microns, is often associated with a granular macular pigmentary change and the characteristic finding is that of late staining punctate hyperfluorescent lesions in a wreath-like configuration surrounding the fovea. Birdshot chorioretinopathy mainly occurs in middle-aged females of North European descent and has a strong correlation with HLA-A29. Fundus shows multiple yellow-white choroidal lesions that are clustered in the posterior pole, more of them inferior and nasal to the disc, radiating towards the periphery and associated with mild anterior uveitis and vitritis. Acute zonal occult outer retinopathy is unilateral, commonly occurs in young myopic females and the initial stages, the fundus appears normal. If you like this video, you may show your appreciation by making a small contribution to help support the channel. Here below the video window, click on super thanks. Choose the amount you would like to contribute and then click buy and send to complete the transaction. Thank you.